Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Feed the Beast Monster on the Feed the Beast Worlds server. Yay! Uh, I realize I do need to apologize. Oh, I have some coffee. For how long that last episode took. But, once again, it takes time to build... A decent episode, I feel. Now, you may notice these pumpkin seeds in my inventory. Don't mind those right now. What you should mind is the harvester that we need to move. Oh, hello, unhappy baby. Yeah, we've been having some problems with the server filling down when us admins are not available to fix it. Go figure. So we're kind of... I'm going to propose to Saul. We need to find someone who plays on here regularly to promote them to council access that lives on the other side of the planet. <laughs> so that way we have full coverage. But anyway, we are moving this grinder over several blocks because we have need of pumpkin seeds. And I think I can go over... You. You. And you. If I go over four collectively... Do, do, do. Let's see, it was here... I need to go over one, two, three, four to properly get well, five to get my pumpkins. So hopefully it still reaches the wheat. Well, I think I'll just put it right here. And then we'll get some pumpkins. We won't get all of them, but we'll get some of them. So harvester down. Uh-oh. I need to move this chest. Right, um, whoa. Um, hold on, we're just gonna, whoa, lag spike. Okay, I hate doing that, but we're gonna do that real quick, just so I can empty this chest some, so I can fit. Sorry, this was not my intent to have to do this quite so much. But I need to be able to fit these in there real quick so I can move the chest over without there being too much stuff put onto the ground because that's not going to help out my frames any if I have all these particles put down. Um, that's good enough. We'll just take these, throw this cotton. I need to make a barrel for this cotton anymore for all of this stuff. It needs to have... That pumps it out into a pipe. Pipes put it into a barrel. And you know what? That might be something that we try today. I need that chest. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Come on, I need the chest. Whee! There it is. Now, I actually have something pretty cool in store. We have to be careful because it's a surprise. It's not so much. Eh, yeah. I am going to start forestry once again. I have not done it since Ultimate. Um, I haven't shared. I don't have any videos of Ultimate up. It was um, at the time I didn't know that I could fix my computer just by simply updating the video graphics card. So yeah, but the first thing you're going to want is a stable seed source to put into a squeezer to get seed oil. Now, at first I was going with wheat in a sag mill right here because I had ridiculous amounts of it. Um, but as you can see, my hay bales have dwindled down quite a bit. I had a full line of hay bales. Um, it just, the hay doesn't keep up the way it should, so... We need to move to pumpkins, which is much more efficient. Hopefully. Oops, I need to put this back in there. 
Now it reaches. And I think I've noticed with the harvester, as long as you put the chest in the back, if the chest is full, if it can't fit anything more in there, then it will stop working. But, you know, you can't put the chest anywhere else because it'll work with anything else, but I don't think it sees anything else. Or anywhere else, the chest, the, like the inventory space and such. So, put the chest in the back. Um, yeah, anyway, yeah. You gotta make sure you get up a stable amount of seed oil. And I dug a new hole. We got this one, big old lava tank, which is powering that. This is the biggest tank you can make. I made it recessed under the walls and sink down a little bit. I think it looked like tanks, this is how they should be. So you can view them. And I don't really much care for the steel tank wall stuff. In fact, I might actually move this tank back a little bit just so that or maybe back and over I'm not sure I know I got other tanks to put in here and I could do some stuff because I'm gonna need a tank for honey I'm gonna need a tank to store this oil up here I'll put these on pillar like th what the how did you get here I'll put these on pillars I think that looks really cool like they're being held up <sighs> So yeah, make sure you get some decent seed things going. There are better ways to get seed oil, but, oh by the way, this is a hopping barrel and this is the most righteous thing in the world. Look at it, it dances. Bing, bing, bing. <laughs> anyway, so once you get the seed oil going, you want to make a, where is it? A beelizer. That's right, we are playing with bees. If you couldn't figure it out by the seed oil. You need a beelizer, so... Huzzah! There it is. Yeah, bet you didn't know that, how that happened, huh? Yes, I made a cut. <laughs> Boss, because I, uh, realized if I'm gonna... I don't know where I'm going with that. Anyway, so now we got a beelizer, which you need. You get, it's got its own GUI, you right-click it. You have to feed it with honey. Well, the only way to get honey is to go and uh, breed some bees and farm them. So the first thing you can do, um, my friend Euron showed me, is that, hold on, we're just going to load up the mod. <clears throat> you actually, the first building you can build and doesn't need seed oil at all. Um, I'm just used to the ultimate way, which, I mean, I never did it in Unleashed, so these were not a thing. You have these bee houses, which you can use with a standard comb. Now, these things, you cannot put frames in them, and, well, I think we'll just, uh, I'll show you real quick. I'll get it set up. I need to go, well... Hmm, I need to go find a comb, so I'll be right back. And I got one. So, yes, I want to see these comb, or these bee house. Because I was not actually aware of this. I would have done, I'd be doing a bunch of these first. Oops, what do I, I don't want to, place. Hi. <laughs> bee house. Yep, you cannot put in frames. But you can breed bees with it. You'd put a princess and a drone up here. Well, you were probably thinking, well, what are those? Well, to start, where's my junk chest? Yeah, we'll throw it in there. No, I don't want it in there. I want it down here. So we can also put that away. Um, you need to make a scoop. Now it does not have to be the thalmium scoop. What is that? Compound recharge focus? I don't know. Um, where'd it go? Alchemy? No. Artifice. No. APMNC. 
Thomium scoop. Now, I prefer to do this, the thomium scoop, because they last much longer. A regular scoop will last anywhere from six to eight hits. So, we're going to go ahead and make one of those real quick. Luckily, I think I still, yep, I still got some thomium, so we don't have to spend all day on this. Unless you wanted me to spend all day on it, I'm sorry. But we're not spending all day on it. Do to do, one wall. I know I could go over to the other chest, but I'm lazy. Do to do, where's my sticks? Where's my sticks? I guess I'll have to make some sticks. Do do. Okay, one one. Oh, I did. I knew I grabbed an extra thomium. Okay, now that we have our scoop, we have to go bee hunting. So, what are we gonna do with that? I will show you. We will go to Warp Wild um, 2. And then this is pretty much what you do. You go around, not lag up. Holy crap, what's. The, wow, this is flat. And you look for beehives. Now this is one of the most annoying things in the world to do because to start, it's daytime. It's best to do this at night because as long as the light updates, beehives glow in the dark. They'll uh, shine up. It's like half the strength of glowstone and makes them much easier to find. Now, there are, you can find a bee in just about every climate. Oopsie, here's one. And once you break it, you have to break it with a scoop or you will not get these bees. As far as I know. I know in Unleashed you could break them with Darkcraft. If you had Darkcraft armor on, whoops. And you'd be able to get them. There are many different types of hives. Uh-oh, jetpacks wavering. And you can find them in just about every climate, but our jetpack is dead, and I sh did, not, did not anticipate that. Because I didn't look! <laughs> the other thing I've been doing on my side progress stuff is... Let's go back. Uh oh there's a zombie pigment out there. You <laughs> see, and that's why I put the gate out there. <laughs> uh, what was I saying? Oh, I've been lighting up the caverns around the area, so there's really no mob spawns in the area anymore, which helps out with my frames because there's less entities. Hello, creeper. I've recently lost my awesome Manioleum sword. I don't know what happened to it. I don't know if... I died once and I visited, well because I visited someone, they had a jet, rotary craft jet turbine going for power or something. I don't know what it was doing. But, oh I'm out of food. Great. Anyway, I was visiting, yeah. And I teleported to them like an idiot, shouldn't have done it and it was because they were asking for help and I got sucked into the jet turbine yeah awesome N no not awesome not, <laughs> not in the least <laughs> sucked um, luckily I did I mean I did die and we have a plugin where it's supposed to gr spawn a gravestone and it didn't but luckily what I thought was all of my stuff made it to oh, what's this water do Ooh, regeneration water that's cool ouch stupid biome I hate this biome yeah what I thought I got all my stuff back apparently I was missing a few things I didn't have my goggles of revealing for thomcraft I didn't have those hello whose house is this I want to visit decent setup. I like it. Good structure. 
Walk around. I don't know whose house this is. But I kind of like it. Other good news is... Oh, ooh, pretty. Oh, and what a view. Look at that view. Oh, I admire you, sir. Or madam. I imagine there are some madams who play on here as well. We could go down and explore more, but we got purpose to do today. We need more beacons. Now, where could they be? I know you can also go, at least I thought, to Twilight, and we might do that. If I don't find another beacon. Oh, here, here we go. Won't even. Yeah, I probably won't find them because somebody else is doing bees around here. So, off to Twilight. Seriously raining in Twilight. Okay. At least in Twilight, the combs should stick out a bit. I hope. Now, there's also there... We need to get a decent... We need to at least get a meadows and some kind of other breeding bee because we gotta start. We're gonna need to breed up some. And I probably shouldn't have bothered going into. Hello, what's with this wood? Oh, it's a bad light update. I. Okay. Ooh, hello. Is there a Naga in here? Oh, there is. Naga fight? Let's see if we can, uh... How much damage it hits us for. Oh! That hurts. Ow! We got no food, either. <laughs> we really should be doing this. <laughs> Yeah, I got no food. Yeah, that's just not gonna happen. Darn. Hold on, there's any red mushroom? Oh, there's red mushrooms here? We are going to... Give me some mushrooms. We can do this. We can do this real quick. I just need one wood. Or, no, I'm going to need two because we need a crafting table. Yeah, it's totally sidetracked today, but we'll just make sure that we uh, move really fast on the other stuff. So we need just a bowl, but we're going to get four. And there are brown mushroom. Give me you. Come on. I don't have to hit you with an axe to get mushrooms. Don't even try that. Thank you. I need more, though. Man, this mushroom's being a jerk. There we go. That'll do it. Uh-oh. Hello, zombie? Get some! Anyway, yeah, I lost my sword. Sorry, I realized that didn't finish that conversation. And I enchanted this one. Knockback 2, looting 2. It's not bad. It's a pretty good sword. For a level 28 enchant, so uh oh, I'm about to get hit. Uh oh, uh oh. Go away. Jeez. Oh, cool. Mushrooms do stacks now. Just need. Yep. That's what I thought. Three. Plenty. Alright, let's go. Now that we can gen health, where'd he go? Oh, don't tell me I lost it. Is it something that only ha comes out so often or something? Aw, come on. Oh, look at the little bunny rabbits! Well, that's not cool. 
I was ready to kill one. I haven't killed one yet. And I still will yet to now. Well, that's just not fair. Okay. Back to looking for... Bee combs. And I don't think I'm going to... Find any... Here. Ooh, a dark forest. I'm not going in there. Okay, so here's a wide open meadow. There sh definitely should be a meadows in here. Red Ram. Hollow Hill. Whoa! What the hell? Okay, we won't go that way. Oh, got it. Ooh, music discs. Stencil. It's probably not single news, so we will take all of that. I cannot believe there are no hives in Twilight. This is where I used to go all the time in Ultimate for extra princesses. I will take this. all the time okay well I'm gonna run around collect up a bunch from overworld I'll just have to fly around I guess I think did I already come this way I don't know that's disappointing so yeah I'm gonna go around collect a bunch and I will see you oh that's weird What? How does this work? Okay. Ooh! I knew it! I think this one's a marbled hive. Oh, curious hive? So that's a new one. Oh, mystical drone. Okay. Aha! I knew there were beehives here. Ooh, cicadas. Ew. Okay. But there's not enough to actually just be like, ooh, there's a hive. Ooh, there's a hive. Ooh, we got tons of bees. So I'm still going to go, and I'm actually going to do it this time. Okay, so... Catch you in a minute.